What is up guys and welcome back or to the channel. I hope you guys had a great weekend um, Today we are going to get our parts back from sandblast and uh, get them delivered to the paint shop um, I already got my uncle's truck this morning. I caught off work for the day to get all this done um, I have the, this pile of parts here also needs to get sandblasted So we're gonna go ahead and take those with us to have him sandblast while we're there um, I think what I want to do is I want to put the axles up on jack stands um, on the trailer. Um, I think it should be fine to drive like that, you know, just as long as they're ratchet strapped down like you normally would them. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to uh, put these jack stands that I have here in the back of my uncle's truck, um, get our, get some ratchet straps for us, get, uh, get some, get some rags to put on the jack stands to have the axle sit on and uh, and that should be it I think um, then we'll go ahead and get hooked up to the trailer um, and then we'll stop and get gas and then we'll make our way out there So we just got on the road with the trailer hooked up. Um, we're gonna go ahead and get some gas here because we only got a quarter of a tank and we got two hours and six minutes of driving and that ain't gonna make it. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and stop at the gas station here before we jump on the highway here. Um, and then I'll catch up with you guys a little bit after we get some gas. <music> so excited right now like it's a huge step all this stuff is gonna be fresh clean no rust no nothing and ready to go to paint so uh, everything's going smooth so far no issues nothing like that um, traffic's pretty light so that's nice that's really nice actually um, so once we get there we're gonna sandblast these couple other parts here that I put on the floor uh, that I forgot the first time like an idiot <laughs> and then uh we will uh go back we'll go back to uh probably the shop and uh we're gonna have to hit the hardware store and uh get some get some allen bolts i guess we'll call it and then uh drill and tap a couple things drill out a couple more holes um because some of the holes are tight or you have to thread the bolt in and I don't want to screw up fresh paint so we're gonna make those holes a little bit bigger so they go right in uh, without scratching up the new paint as much as possible it's gonna happen but we'll try and prevent that as much as we can because um, you don't want to you don't want to scratch up your new paint and go down to bare metal and then you're gonna start rusting all over again and you're in the same boat so uh, yeah guys we're just cruising right now um yeah that's about it so i'll catch up with you guys here in a little bit Alright guys, 
Woods, we're about 12 minutes out from uh, the sandblast place. Um, I'm super excited. The drive's been really smooth. Um, pretty light traffic for the most part, no issues. Um, so that was super good. Uh, there was no issues until I just missed that turn. Ah, <laughs> uh, man. Find somewhere to turn around, I guess. All right, so we got turned around. We're all good. Um, we're about 15 minutes away. That sucks. That took a bunch of my time off. Oh, well. Um, so, yeah, we're almost there, and I'll pick you guys back up as we're getting ready to pull in. All right, guys, so we have just left uh, the sandblast place. Uh, did a super good job. I'm super happy with it. Um, the drive was, was it was well worth the drive. Uh, the quality of work was very, very good. I was impressed. And uh, helped me load it down, load it up, tie it down, make sure nothing's gonna go anywhere because in Ohio, the roads suck and they're bumpy and there's potholes everywhere and you never know what you're gonna come across. And he helped me get it tightened down and everything nice and organized to where nothing is going to go anywhere. So I'm super happy with it. So now we're going to go ahead and make our way home, guys. Um, we got to go home and uh, we got to drill out some of them holes a little bit more on the four link brackets and uh, drill and tap on the four link brackets as well um, to. Uh, Put the Allen the Allen bolts in for the for the name plates. So uh, I will catch you guys when we get back. Oh yeah, nice full tank before we get home. Oh, before we hit the road to go home, we're good on gas, but uh, pretty cheap on it for a dollar ninety. Couldn't exactly pass that one up, guys. It's gonna be a tight fit. Alrighty, so we're good to go. We're gonna hop on the road here and head back home. What's up, guys? We are about 10 minutes from home, probably. Um, we're gonna go ahead and stop at the hardware store, Ace Hardware, um, and uh, get them Allen bolts. Or Allen, yeah, whatever. Get them Allen bolts for the nameplates, um, just because it's kind of on the way home, and I don't really want to make a whole nother trip out. Um, I kind of want to try and keep it as minimal as possible, just keep the flow going, keep stuff, you know, happening a little bit faster as the day goes. Um, it's about two o'clock right now. It's 1:55, so we're making good time. Um, Hopefully have it to the paint shop by like 3, 3, 3.30 is the goal, if not earlier. Um, so yeah, we're almost there. Um, I'll catch you guys once we get back to the shop. Alright guys, so we are finally back at the shop. Um, we already hit the hardware store and got our Allen bolts. Um, so what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and take these plates after I put gloves on because the oil is from your hand will uh, end up making that rust. So I'm not gonna touch it with bare hands. Uh, we all use gloves when we are loading it up. So anyway, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take this. I'm gonna put it where I want on this um, and I'm gonna go ahead and mark it. I'm also gonna put one here and one here as well. So there's gonna be six uh, Allen bolts holding each of these name plates on to this four link mount. Um, so I'll place it, mark it with a Sharpie in the holes drill it out and then i hope i have a tap that's the same thread pitch as these um and then we'll go ahead and take everything to paint Alright guys, 
guys so we got really really pressed for time um and i didn't really have time to get the camera going on and off uh they're gonna close here kind of soon so i drilled all the holes um i didn't get to tap them i didn't have the right thread tap for it so uh that just we'll just have to do that once we get the axles back i'm gonna get everything back from paint and then i'll just i'll have to draw it a little bit more and tap it and i'll have to clear coat over it that way it don't start rusting or anything but we're good to, we're good to go other than that um so i will catch you guys once we get to uh the paint shop guys we made it here the camera might die in the middle of us unloading everything um so if it does i'll catch up with you after we get everything unloaded I had said um the camera's probably gonna die it ended up being yesterday um so we got everything unloaded there and everything set up in the booth um today i actually went and we started looking at colors um they're gonna have to get special colors in for me um because for one of the colors um it's so wild they don't even know how we're gonna do it yet um so we gotta get special paint chips in um for that color so uh we'll have to see how long it'll take for them to get that color in um the other colors should be fairly simple um but i want to wait till we get the crazy color in to kind of compare it with it um so we'll just have to wait and see um how it's gonna go um so that'll be it for this video guys um thanks for watching be sure to subscribe we have a big reveal coming up here probably within the next two weeks um, the Rangers should be done probably mid to later this week. Um, we're still waiting on that rear brake hose um, that goes from the steel line down to the distribution block. Um, we had to get that specially ordered. It came in from the Midwest, I believe the parts store said. Um, so we're still waiting on that. Um, but yeah, that's about it. So once again, guys, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe, and I will catch you guys next time.